The words of people about to die, if they are fully conscious, are usually very well chosen and important. That was certainly true in the case of today's saint, Paul Miki, a Japanese Jesuit seminarian who, along with 25 others, was martyred in Nagasaki. Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, a Jesuit priest and the U.S. Director of the Apostleship of Prayer. The martyrs we honor today were tied to crosses and then killed by soldiers who thrust a spear into each one of their chests. An eyewitness gave the following account of St. Paul Miki's last words. Having arrived at this moment of my existence, I believe that no one of you thinks I want to hide the truth. That is why I declare to you that there is no other salvation than the one followed by Christians. Since this way teaches me to forgive my enemies and all who have offended me, I willingly forgive the emperor and all those who have desired my death, and I pray that they will obtain the desire of Christian baptism. At this point, he turned his eyes toward his companions and began to encourage them in their final struggle. The faces of them all shone with great gladness. Another martyr shouted to him that he would soon be in paradise. Like my master, Paul Miki said, I shall die upon the cross. Like him, a lance will pierce my heart so that my blood and my love can flow out upon the land and sanctify it to his name. May we Christians of the 21st century have such courage and love which, as we know, comes only from the sacred heart of Jesus.